Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is The Stitching Colourist with Shelley Lewis. So today's video is going to be an unboxing. Now this one is from Seven Great and they contacted me on the 1st of November to see if I would like to unbox and review one of their products for them. So they did have a suggestion and they asked me if I wanted to choose a kit myself so that's what I did so I'm going to be showing you that today and also at the end of the video I'll be telling you about their Black Friday event that they've got going on so without further ado we shall take out what we've got so there was supposed to send me what was two little clips two grips to go around a cross stitch uh, when you've got it in the hoop however that was the suggestion however I noticed that they've not actually sent me that in the package so I probably will get in touch with them and just let them know um, that I didn't receive this in the didn't receive it in the package it's just the kit that I chose so I'll we'll go into the kit so sorry about the crinkle I'll make it quick so, I don't know if cross stitch companies where the kits come from are stopping doing the picture in full size where they used to have it on the front. Because I've noticed with a couple of my kits now, it's not had a big picture of what it is on the front. So, what I'll do is I can show you now in the video but what i'll do is i'll include a picture at the end of the video of what this kit is but if you can see from there it's stitch in a christmas outfit so i thought i would go with something christmassy as we're in november now and soon it will be december before you know it and i don't seem to have a lot of christmassy kits either so i thought it'd be nice so we have our instruction sheet, whether you're new to cross stitch or a returning cross stitcher. You've got stitch instructions, notes and cleaning and maintenance. And also your embroidery descriptions at the bottom. I have a lot of those. You get these with every kit that you have. We have a tool kit in one of these little Ziploc baggy bags. <laughs> We have a needle threader, a thimble, a pom-pom with about five gold tip, gold tip needles. I quite like those. I do get on well with those. I know some people that don't get on well too much with these, but I've not had a problem with those. So, yeah, I've got tons of those as well. So... I'll show you a little bit of the chart. So it is an 11 count, so it will be stitched using three strands and it is a 40 by 40, which, um, yeah, all my kits that I have are, <laughs> are usually quite big now, so I went for something more little. So the chart itself, um, it looks all right. It doesn't look too small. Um... Yeah, it's not too bad actually. We've not got any blurring on the pattern where the ink has uh, bled through, so we're all right there. You've got your code at the side, uh, which this has got 35 colours, and you've got your symbols and your corresponding, I was going to say CXC code, and it is stitched. It is 147 by 147 cent stitches, not centimetres. Stitches. So we're going to have a look at the colours next because I like to leave the camera still there. So the colours, you've got your corresponding code on here. What you also have on the canvas itself. So say please, your threads and the canvas. Um get separated you can match it back up so i had a message come through then just bear with me a second sorry about that guys so it's all right i had a message come through so it's possible someone might be coming around in a minute so i'm gonna try and be a bit quicker this one 
So one thing I do want to mention in this video, because somebody actually mentioned this to me in one of the previous videos they've watched, which to be fair, they do have a point. I was probably just wording it wrong. So I'll word it right. So we've got these hanks here. We've got three hanks of 5200. Zero, zero. Now, when I, in a previous video, when I've showed you these hanks and I've said they're extra hanks, yeah, they're not extras as in they give you extra. Basically, when you have a lot of one colour, because obviously they can't fit all that on the card, they will, what number is it? I don't know. They will thread one little bit on the card if i can find it here which is 35 but they'll thread a little bit on there but obviously because it's a color that they the requires a lot of they will give you them in hanks as well so i just wanted to clear that up guys um i do apologize if anyone was a bit confused by that before but i thought i'd just um let you know so our colours, we have these. So we have a few, we have dark red there, browns, blues, greens. Well, that, that might be 939 actually. We've got a bright orange here, a palish light rose, a colour, some greys, some really light colours. I like that mint colour there, that's nice. So that is colours 19 to 35. And then from colours 1 to 18, we have these. Get some more browns, blues, like a rosy colour, red, purples, greens. And I like this one on the end. That is gorgeous. That, that is a gorgeous colour. So those are the colours. I'll just wind that back up a minute. All right, if anyone does come while I'm doing this video, I'll just pause the video. So, just wind them up. So, we're going to have a look at the canvas now. And I might be able to get most of this on camera. So, the canvas itself, we've got it there. <laughs> So the edges, they're not too thick, but they're not too thin either. It's quite a decent edge, but the edges are surged, so we don't need to worry about fraying too much at all. As I said before, it's stitched on 11 cow data, so it requires three strands of thread. So I just want to quickly say, if you are a bit confused on how many strands of thread you used on fabric, on 11 count aiders, you use three strands of thread. On a 14 count aider, you use two strands of thread. But with that, with a 14 count, you can always take one strand out, then fold it over. And yeah. So anyway, yeah. It's 40 by 40 centimetres, as I stated before. And it's 147 by 147 stitches. Up here, we have a small picture of what the kit is, which you can't see too much, but it's not too bad. And we've got 35 colours, your symbols and your corresponding CXE code. Now here, the background is required. 35 is, is blue, which is 5200, which we've got these. So technically, to be fair, I could stitch this without doing the background I could just stitch stitch itself because if you think about it it's white fabric anyway so I don't necessarily have to stitch the background if I don't want to I can just do stitch itself so I'm not sure yet it would be a shame not to do the background but to be to do the background it will take a lot more yeah it's going to take longer to do the background so i think what i might do is when i do start this i'm gonna start on stitch first get him finished and then see what he looks like without doing the background and if i'm happy with him 
just the main bit done then i will just do stitch and leave the background or if i feel like it needs a bit more then i will do the background so quality of the stamping so the stamping looks fine i can see here red boxes with white circles in those look clear um I'm a little bit unsure about that one it might be a green dot let's look on this side so they, 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 they don't look too bad you've got a little bit of confetti stitching round here but putting this in a nice little frame you'll soon get that done so yeah yeah i'm quite pleased with that the stitching is fine so yeah so all together you get the fabric obviously you get your instructions for if you know to cross stitch your chart your tool kit and your threads so this kit on the website on in dollars it costs nine dollars 74 or in the uk it is seven pound 85 now, I'm going to tell you about their Black Friday event. So, basically, you get 20% off the entire website. So, it's a 20% discount code, which is 20 Flea Black Friday. So, in the Black Friday, it's an uppercase B and an uppercase F. So, it's 23 Black Friday 20. I'll put that in the description below. I'll put the whole... Um, black friday information in the description below so you can use it unlimited and it goes from nine november the 10th until november the 30th now i know that we're all ready in november the 15th today um but yeah and the other bit is you five dollars off orders over and 55 six dollars over 66 dollars seven dollars off over 77 dollars ten dollars off over 99 dollars 16 dollars off over 139 dollars and 20 dollars off over 159 dollars and as well the second offer second promotion and first promotion they can be used together so you get even extra off so say if you went for the five dollars off orders over 55 as well as getting the five dollars off you could get another twenty dollars off that so basically you'd be getting twenty five dollars off over 55 which is quite good actually that's not bad well, not $25 because it's 20%, not $20. So, yeah, um, 20%. It's roughly about, mm, about $15 off, I'd think, something like that. So, anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it here for now because, like I said, I think we we have got somebody coming around in a second. So, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please feel free to give the video a big thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. If you're not already a subscriber, then please feel free to press that subscribe button. I would love to have you here. And also, before you go, I just want to quickly tell you, I have started a new channel. And I'm keeping fingers crossed how it goes well. It's not craft related. It's actually makeup and movie discussion related. So if that is something that is going to interest you, then please feel free to go and check it out. It's called Makeup and Movies. And it's an uppercase M and an uppercase uh, M for movies. I will put the link in the description below. Um, it's basically I'm going to just be talking about different movies and telling you about some fun facts and everything whilst I just do makeup. I did the first episode today and the episode one is based on Scream 1. So anyway, I'm going to get going now, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Thank you for being with me. I really, really do appreciate it. And I'll see you again soon. So goodbye for now, guys. Bye.